The experiments you will see have been carefully done by professionals and should not be tried at home without parental guidance. Please follow the caution signs throughout this program. Welcome to Creation is Science, where we learn about our Creator through fun and interesting ways through science and discovery. Are you ready to join us? I'm Aunt Francine, and this is Professor Roy. How are you today? I'm good. Glad to be here. I'm so excited. Whenever you're here on the set, there's a lot of fun things going on. I'm good. And here we also have Dia. Hi, Dia. Elon. Hi. Carter. Hi, cool. And Liam. Well. Wow. Got a good bunch of kids. We do. We do. You like to do stuff? I do. You do? Really? I do. Oh, I'll tell you what, you know, we got a lot of interesting things to do. You know, some people can do things, I mean, really well because they practice a lot, right? Yes. You know, we've got somebody here, you know, Dia, you know, I heard that Dia has some skills. And so we're going to check this out, aren't we? I think we are. Now, now let's see. Now, Elon, I want you to get something on the, on the shelf right here. Come on up here, Dia, because Dia is going to go ahead and get those things because uh, Dia has a, a very interesting skill. She can juggle. Can you juggle stuff? No. Okay, well, she's going to juggle some uh, oh, fruit juggle. right here. We have a couple of oranges, I think they are. Let's see if she can juggle for us. Let's see what we got. Oh, cool. That's interesting. How many How many of you can juggle? Can Ooh, you juggle? Oh, that's pretty cool. Now, now, now that's interesting. Now, how long have you been juggling? I don't know. You don't Just know? Just a couple months. Just a couple of months. Okay, so did you have to practice? Yeah. Okay, so you learned how to juggle. Mm -hmm. That's interesting. You know, there's something else that you can do really well that a lot of people can't, and I heard about it. Somebody told me and that was riding a one-wheel bicycle. Mm -hmm. So could you show us that? Wow. Yes. Okay, so what do we got? Are you going to take your coat off for that? Okay. But well, we have a one-wheel bicycle right here, and this is called, what is this called? Unicycle. Called a unicycle, right? Una. Okay, it's one. One bicycle, or one piece of a bicycle, one part of a bicycle, and she's going to ride it for us, because that's interesting. Now, how long have you been riding a unicycles? About a year. About a year. Now, that's interesting. So, I'm wondering if you could just kind of ride it all the way across the studio right here. Let's see how well she can ride this bicycle. And there she goes. And, oh, oh, that's okay. No problem. Okay. okay. Now she's going to try it again. That's interesting. And it's very difficult to know because I've it's what? Been brave enough. You have to have a good balance, don't you? You have to have good balance to ride that bicycle Ooh, or the unicycle. Look at that. Look at her go. She did a great job. Let's Yay. give her a nice hand. That yeah. was excellent. That was so cool. But you know what? I've got something, you know, she could only ride the unicycle because she has what? Practice. practice. She has practice. You know, practice makes perfect, doesn't it? Yeah. yeah. Well, at least perfect practice makes perfect. <laughs> That's how we learn things. Well, you know, I've got another, I've got another skill for you to, to learn. Now, see, Dia, I've got a special bike right here. Let's take a look at this special bike. That's interesting. Now, this bicycle right here, does it have one wheel? No. no, it's a buy. Buy two. Buy means two. So we have a two-wheeled bicycle. But if you can ride a unicycle that only has one wheel, shouldn't it be a lot easier for her to ride a bicycle that has two wheels? Yeah. Or maybe if we That's had a, a three-wheel bicycle like a tricycle, that would even be better, wouldn't it? Yeah. <laughs> well, that's interesting. So let's see what we got. So I have a bicycle right here. Now, when you ride a bicycle, do you wear a helmet? Yes. Okay, but if you don't wear a helmet, then you shouldn't be riding a bicycle. Isn't that yes. right? Let's see what we got right here. Let's see if we can figure out this little catch right here. I'm going to take this right here. Okay, why don't you go ahead and put that on for us, all right? Because she's going to wear that for us, and hopefully that will clip on her really good. All right, now this bicycle, it's a regular bicycle. Well, it's not regular. It does something special, and this seat will go up a little bit, but maybe you can ride that. Can you ride that across the studio right here? There you go. She's gonna, she's gonna go. Yep. Hey, she, she can ride a bicycle, and she rode that just about as well as she did the unicycle. Isn't that interesting? <laughs> yeah. Okay, we'll bring it back. Bring it on back right here because we're gonna do something special. What we're gonna do something special is this. We're not gonna take the wheels off of the bicycle, but we're gonna do something else. This is what I'm gonna do. Now I'm gonna take, I'm gonna take the steering wheel. Is that a steering wheel? Yes. Or we call it a what? Ball. Okay. 
handlebars. Handlebars, that's right. It's not a wheel, it's a handlebar. But you know, we've got two gears right there, and if I take the handlebars off, and if I put the handlebars on this shaft right here, you know what happens? Uh -oh. um, when I turn the handlebars, <laughs> you need to watch this. When I turn the handlebars to the right, what direction does the front wheel go? Left. It goes to the left. And when I turn the handlebars to the left, what direction does the front wheel go? go? Right. right. So it goes the opposite direction. Isn't that interesting? Yeah. Well, I think so. <laughs> That's interesting. So let's see what we got right here. Whoa. Let's see. I'm wondering if anybody could ride this bicycle. Who could ride? Exactly. You want to try it? You want to give it a try? There you go. Put that helmet on right here. All right, there we go. Put the helmet on. There you go. And just clip that underneath your chin. Okay, you can ride a bicycle? Yeah. Yes. Okay, so we're going to see if you can ride. Now, what you have to remember is what? If you want to go left, what are you going to do with the handlebars? Turn right. I'm going to turn right. If you want to go right, what are you going to do with the handlebars? Go left. Turn left. So you understand that, right? Yeah. Okay, he understands <laughs> what to do, but can he do it? That's the question. Okay, and I'll be right here just in case you want to fall, okay? Okay. All right, let's give it a try. Be careful, be careful. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa. Okay, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. You understand <laughs> what we're doing? Uh, yeah. Okay, we're going that direction. Okay. okay. All right, <laughs> give it a try. Okay. All right, there we go, and he's going to start off again. See, let's see. Is it's it difficult. is it hard? Yeah, that's it's, really difficult. It's really difficult, isn't it? I yeah. think that's really good. You want to give it a try? Go sure. Ahead. I mean, you don't have to. It's up to you. Okay, put on those. Put on the seat. Put on. Put on the okay. helmet. There we go. You know, most Oops. bicycle ask accidents. Oops. You know what they do? Too. Most people that have an accident on a bicycle, what do they injure? Head. They injure their head. It's about 90% of all bicycle accidents are head injuries. So remember, put on a helmet when you ride a bicycle. Okay, there you go. You want to give it a try? All right, here we go. All right, now you've been riding a bicycle for what, 10 years or so? No. <laughs> no? Maybe four. Maybe four years. Okay, so you know how to do it. All right, so give this a try, all right? And the seat will go down if you need it. Is that okay? All right, so we're going to go this direction over here. Give it a nice try. That's right, get that wheel point. Whoa, 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 whoa. okay. Okay, all right. Now remember, we're gonna go that way. There you go, yeah, point the wheel over there. Okay, here we go. And, no, no, ah! is that a little bit difficult? Yeah. It's really difficult, isn't it? I'm used to when I turn right, the wheel goes right. I know, mm -hmm. okay, that's a regular bicycle. Yeah. But this is a very special science bike and it's all in reverse, isn't that cool? Yeah. Yeah, it really is cool. Hey, I wonder if Dia, you think Dia could do this? Uh, yeah, let's go well, try. Well, go she try. can ride a one a wind wheel <laughs> bicycle. Well, why not a two wheel bicycle? Okay, let's see what we got. Okay, are you ready? You want to give it a try? Sure. Okay, she needs that helmet. Who's We're got that helmet? We're working on it. We're working. There we on go. It. All right, thank All right, you. There we go. We're gonna put our helmet on. Like All right. Tie it up. All right. Okay. Are you ready? Yes. Okay, so we're gonna head in that direction right there. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Okay. We've got Professor Roy. Yeah, remember, we're, we're going that way. Okay. Okay, we're going in that direction right here. Okay, all right. Yep, and there she goes. She got her pedals almost ready. Oh. This has coaster brakes on it. Oh, whoop, 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 whoop. You okay? Yeah. I don't yeah. Think Is it's that good. a little bit hard? Yes. It's really difficult, isn't it? It's really difficult. It has a, why don't you go ahead and put the kickstand down right there for us. Hey, I want, I want to thank you guys for helping us do that. You know, there's something else that I wanted you to try. Could you go ahead and get some paper for us, Elon? Elon's going to give each one of you a, a, a piece of paper. And you got some pens for us. Go ahead and pass those pens out. What I want you to do is I want you to try something that's a little bit difficult for you to do. And that is take the pencil or the pen or the marker. And I want you to write your name with your opposite hand. Oh, I can do it. You can do it. Okay, good. Because we want to see how you're doing. Okay, go ahead. We need some more markers over here. And write your name with the opposite hand, okay? And if you know how to write in cursive, you can write in cursive. Otherwise, you're going to have to print. And uh, I can't do it at all. You're going to have to do it. <laughs> and Francine's going to have to do it right here. Go ahead and start writing it. Let's see what you, let's see what you can come up with right here. Shall we do that? Okay. Oh, that's interesting. Now, Dia, why don't you hold yours up so we can see Dia's over here? Check that out. Now, that looks really good. Oh, that man. looks really good. Show them over she here. looks good. That really, looks really good. Yeah. Nice job. Nice job. Let's see how we're doing over here. Okay. Elon, how are you doing? 
the kind. You're doing pretty good with that. We're about to Almost answer. Did that with Why don't you show us? Is that, <laughs> That's your, is that your opposite cute. hand? It is. That's really good with your opposite hand. Okay. Oh, so what about hard. Carter? Are you done? Carter's yeah. working on it for us right and here. It takes some concentration. And Liam, what about you? Oh, my God. Show us yours. Oh, no, show the camera right here. Show the camera. Show, okay. Turn it around. Now turn that's it around. interesting. You know, you know why it's hard for us to do things opposite? Because our brain. Oh yeah. Hey, this is great. Now he did a pretty good job. He I did can read good it. Good job. You but it's love. probably not as good as your your regular writing, yeah, is it? My, my regular oh. writing. Is but you know, it's something that we call neuroplasticity. You know, that bicycle is a good example of neuroplasticity because it's all about your balance and you're doing something the opposite way that you normally do in real life. And that's really, really hard, isn't it? With that's my right, right hand, I can do my... With your right hand, it looks a lot nicer, isn't it? And, it and really does. That. Now, have you ever known anybody that had maybe a... Uh, maybe they had a stroke. You know anybody that's ever had a stroke? Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, that's very serious, isn't it? With a stroke, you know what happens? part of your brain dies. That's right, part of your brain dies. Maybe it was part of your brain that you that was useful so that you could use your right arm. But if part of that brain dies and you can't use your right arm anymore, maybe it had to do with your speech or maybe the way that you walked in your left or your right leg. But you know what happens? Our brains were created so intelligently that our brains can accommodate for that. And you could use another part of your brain in order to learn that same skill over again. Isn't that cool? Yeah. yeah. It's all about neuroplasticity. But if you practice riding that backward steering bicycle, you could ride it with without any problem at all. Did you know that? Wow. Yeah. I wonder how long it would take you. What do you think? Uh, months. <laughs> months? What about weeks? Maybe just months. about hours. Yeah. But I practice and I can ride it, not very well, but I can ride it. You wouldn't want me to go on a bike ride with you because I'd have a hard time staying on the trail, but I can ride that bicycle. So I practice for hours. Isn't that interesting? Yeah. yeah. I think so. You want to see me do it? Yeah. 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 You want to see me crash, don't you? Yeah. Oh, yeah. put your helmet on. Oh, put that's your right. helmet Let's on. Let's put a helmet on. Yeah. Maybe I got there you maybe go. I just Okay, I'm going to put <laughs> the helmet on. I don't know. Okay, let's get these things done right here. Here we go. All let's right. let's see what we got. All right. I'm going to try brave. to fasten this thing. Oh, there we go. All right, here we go. All right. Yay. Now go, remember, Professor remember, Roy. remember, I'm not very good. Okay, are you ready? All right, here I we go. I hope I am. Let's try this. Okay, here we go. Let's Woo! go. Whoa, 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 whoa. You know what? That's about all that I can do with my bicycle. Isn't that cool? That That's is interesting. Cool. You know, I'm wondering, do you have something, do you have a Bible text that we could look at? You know, I do have, let's get Romans 7, verse 15. And you know what? We know that sometimes it takes practice. And sometimes they say to make a new habit, it takes maybe 21 to 66 days. That takes some practice, right? It doesn't does. even happen in a week, does it? No. No. And sometimes they say it can even take 200 and let's see, 54 days to make a practice. So you had to practice a lot. But you know what? Let's read our Bible text. Okay. Romans 7 verse 15 reads, For what I am doing, I do not understand. For what I will to do, that I do not practice. But what I hate, that I do. Hmm. That tells me that we have to really put forth effort, right? Because just like that bicycle that was going the wrong way, sometimes we make a mistake, right? We do what we don't want to do, and what we really want to do, that's what we're doing. Yeah. That's exactly what he was talking about, right? That's right. And yeah. so who can only be the one that can help us with these good habits? Jesus. God. You're right, Jesus. Jesus and God. So we need to depend on God, don't we? Absolutely. And we have to ask Him daily to live in our hearts yes. so that we can live for Him. Because we don't want to be backwards. We want to take the extra practice by reading our Bible. What else can we do? Pray. Pray. So we can always depend on God. Thank you for joining us on Creation is Science! Science.